I was first introduced to social media by way of Hurricane Katrina. First, of course, to access resources and, of course, my loved ones who were scattered about. But in so doing, I was inter introduced to Yahoo 360. I was introduced to MySpace, which, which was a little bit more social back then. And like many people do, first I just kind of posted me and my experience and my journey from day to day. And people developed an interest. People not only wanted to know about me, but they wanted to know about what I, what I did in New Orleans, um, what type of lifestyle I lived in New Orleans, and, and, and what voodoo looked like. So it was from there that I was introduced to the popular sites that I utilize today. Um, Instagram, Facebook, um, Twitter, and of course you, YouTube. And another uh, site I like to use is Blog Talk Radio. I've been doing Blog Talk Radio since Hurricane Katrina. And it's in that space that I share spirituality, religion, culture, uh, tradition, New Orleans, uh, New Orleans culture flavor. Um, and then I was introduced to doing live podcasts on YouTube once they developed uh, the means to do so. So I use social media a great deal, particularly uh, YouTube, where I can see people and and they can see me and, and sort of connect uh, on that level. Blog Talk Radio um, seems to be consistent, even when there's buffering or some other video issue. Um, I use Blog Talk Radio as a backup to support the audio um, and the importance of what I'm saying and what's being said and ask during the course of my podcast. And I use Instagram because it's popular, uh, just like Facebook. So I promote my show. I connect with my community in terms of grassroots information, resources, uh, housing, jobs, uh, ceremonies to come, things of that nature. So I love my social media. Uh, I'm typically on social media 24 hours a day.